Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. So in my previous video, I have integrated Atom Payment Gateway and in this video, I'm going to show you that one error that I have faced when I was integrating Atom Payment Gateway. And second one is how to create error log file. And third one is after payment how you can redirect to payment success or failure page so these three points i'm going to cover in this video so let me show you first so basically i have faced error in customer address where there is a new line as address is stored in text format so it can take a new line character so let me edit address in text so i can press enter and write anything so it takes New line character. So in a URL, new line character gives a error. So go to payment page, enterprise, and it's giving us error for log file. As Atom is not able to create error log file. So let's go to transaction request file. And if you will go to end, there you can see a function that is write log, and it's actually just giving log slash so we need to pass complete path to the file so inside f open write complete path that is f path slash controller slash atom ci atom pay slash log so let's go to browser again and refresh now you can see it's giving us a error for new line detected now in atom folder there is a log folder open file there is a link you can see there are three lines but in actual there should be only one line so in checkout function pass address after string replace that checking that there is no new line character So copy customer address and paste, change customer address that is received in a post and write string replace with slash n that is for new line character and replace that. I'm going to replace that with dash. And subject is customer address variable now let's go to browser and check once again enterprise and submit now let me pass slash n and replace that with dash and let's take first one in array and pass three things in that that is slash n slash r and combination of both so refresh again now you can see there is a dash in address so now let's go and remove exit again refresh now you can see it's going to atom payment page so in net banking choose atom bank and click on pay now click on success now we will check there is a row in db so I have shown you first two that is how to resolve error and creating log file. So now let's move to redirect. Right, redirect. Uh, before redirecting, let's check F code as we will be redirecting according to our F code. So in if condition, write post F code if it's equal to you can say ok then redirect to payment slash payment success write else if and in that write redirect to payment failure and in if condition check for f code that is equal to f and last is else redirect that to payment cancel now you can create these three function in the same file that is public function 
payment success and I'm just right now printing payment success you can create your own view I'm just copy same and write payment failure payment failed payment cancel function payment cancel now if I'll refresh that is payment success so that's how you can redirect to this payment page that you have created so I have shown you complete atom payment gateway integration so please like share and subscribe to my channel thank you so much for watching